In this Blender tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can rotate objects. Here I have a photogrammetry scan of a duck, but because of some inconsistencies in the way it was scanned, it came into Blender at a weird angle. Often, if you have a photogrammetry scan, it will be rotated correctly, but many times photogrammetry scans have strange origins. It's best to fix this in the photogrammetry software, but we can also fix it in Blender. Select the object in Blender, then over on the left we have Rotate Tools. Each of these tools rotates the object in a different axis. So if I rotate on the red here, it rotates in the X axis. If I rotate on the Y circle, which is the green one in Blender, it rotates on Y, and I can rotate it in the Z axis. At first it can be a little tricky to figure out how to rotate the object. So using this viewport alignment tool at the top right, click on X. Now we're looking directly in the X direction, and then I can use the red circle to rotate the duck so it's flat this direction. Then if I click Y, I can then see directly in the Y direction and rotate the duck so it's flat in the Y direction. Then I can double check X and then rotate it back. You need to double check both times because you're kind of slowly creeping up on what is level. And if you do this a few times, it will rotate and be flat. If I press G, I can then move the duck up to the top. In a previous video, I showed how to scale a duck, but it's very simple to scale an object in Blender. Just press S and you can scale the object down. Notice that it's scaled around the object's origin point and not the bottom of the duck, so we need to reposition it. Simply look from the side, then press G and move the duck onto the pedestal. So now we have our rotated duck. It is scaled and we're ready to make a beautiful render of our duck. Hopefully this allows you to rotate objects in Blender. Happy 3D modeling.